cells have conceived life and created human race. Every step of life science has created new possibility for the human race. Stem cell transplantation is creating new life miracles. Stem cell is the source of life. Mammalian life starts from fertilized ovum. Fertilization happens 12 hours after ovulation. 30 hours after fertilization. Fertilized ovum reaches uterus via uterine tube and then goes through constant cleavage division. About 50 to 72 hours later, when the fertilized ovum is divided into 8 to 16 cells, a solid ball called marula is formed where every fertilized ovum has the ability of differentiating into over 200 different kinds of cells that will become organ and an intact individual. And this is called cell totipotency. An individual can be formed by putting any marula in the uterus. Stem cell is called the omnipotent cell in medical field. So what is it on Earth? It is a kind of long-term surviving undifferentiated cell and initial cell in all tissues. It is capable of self-renewal and self-reproduction and has the potential functional capacity of reproducing various kinds of tissues and organs. It is inhomogeneous cell colony without direct morphological characteristics. It can be cultured in vitro for a long period of time and reproduce infinitely. It can produce at least one kind of well-differentiated daughter cell. It is multipotential. The stem cell has been known for over 100 years. In 1896, Wilson has proposed the concept of stem cell in illustrating ancestral cell of parasite reproductive system. In 1898, the father of stem cell research, the scientist Thompson, has first extracted and cultivated embryonic stem cell in humans' embryo. In 2006, Japanese scientist Shinya Yamanaka has succeeded in IPS cells induction. Thus, British scientist John B. Gurdon and he won the Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine in certain microenvironment. Stem cells can have induced differentiation into various tissues and organs that human body needs. Hepatic cells, cardiac muscle cells, and nerve cells, etc., which are full of strong ductility. Stem cells exist in every stage of human's growth, but they decrease in number and degrade in differentiated potentiality with human's growth. Stem cell can be divided into three types according to its differentiated potentiality. Totipotent stem cells, pluripotent stem cells, and unipotent stem cells. Another three types according to its origin. Embryonic stem cell, somatic stem cell, pluripotent stem cell. What attracts people most of embryonic stem cells lies in its functioning as seed cell in transplantation, treating various refractory diseases including Parkinson's disease, diabetes, liver cirrhosis, and renal diseases, etc. Embryonic stem cell, besides, can be used to study molecule and cell mechanism in the early development of human embryo and the influence of chromosome disorder on early development of human embryo. Stem cell transplant in four ways, intervention, local implantation, intravenous way, and lumbar puncture. 
among which intervention and local implantation is the safest and the most ideal way so far, and also most commonly used in Chinese modern research center, Asia, of stem cell therapy for stem cell transplant. Take liver cirrhosis for an example. The general procedure, colony cell stimulating factor, should be given to the patient two days before the transplantation, for two days in succession, and then take bone marrow from the patient. Deliver it to stem cell center lab for an out-of-body separation, purification, and multiplication. Send stem suspension to interventional department via hepatic artery where it will be slowly returned to sick liver. Stem cell goes into liver and then differentiate into hepatic cell. It's an undisputed fact in medical mainstream that stem cell can effectively treat various cell damage diseases. China takes the lead in clinical application of stem cell in the world. In August 2010, Obama approves that government funding for stem cell research. At the same time, states in America also make relevant new policies to support stem cell research. On March 2, 2009, the number 18 document of Ministry of Public Health of China approves relevant research of stem cells clinical treatment, showing that China has been the third country to legalize stem cell treatment after England and America. In 2012, Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine is awarded for England scientist John B. Gurdon and Japanese scientist Shinya Yamanaka.